Hello and welcome. This is Lisa Jones, and you are listening to the Exploring Death Podcast. Hello and welcome. It's Lisa Jones with the Exploring Death Podcast. And today I have with me Austin Wells. Austin is a spiritual medium, grief counselor, and soul gardener who empowers individuals to create soul-centered lives. She combines intuition and mediumship with shamanism, energy medicine, and sacred ceremony. Well, how about I pull a few cards? I'm so excited today. I love it. You've got some cards that you're actually going to pull. I know. So let me, um, I'll start with my, my soul coaching cards here. And um, just, how fun are these yeah. ones that you created? No, I, I would love to. These are my teacher Denise Lynn's cards called Soul oh, Coaching. Oh, how lovely! Cards. Yeah, okay. do you know Denise? Are I don't know her personally, but okay. I her work and it's beautiful. Yes, so, I've worked with her so many years ago, and um, these cards uh, they just have always resonated with me. And I figure, she does hey, good stuff. that's right, that's right. Yeah. So um, the first card is the blockage card. I pulled three cards. And so it's uh, success. So what I'm getting there is that you are just on mm-hmm. this meteorite <laughs> <laughs> success. Like your whatever success you've had so far is just the beginning. I mean, truly with this new book coming out and, mm-hmm. and you're just following your soul's path. And I just keep getting the more you're you, the more success, you know, is coming your way. Yeah. And so your action card is sanctuary. It's, you know, taking more time for yourself and really making sure that you don't um, blow yourself out as the words coming through, like, don't, um, (laughs) don't overdo it. Does does that make sense to you? Anyway, so be sure to, as I say, take time for sanctuary and reflection and, and just really patting yourself on the back for all that you do. And, um, and then your outcome card, which I love is just a, it's just opening, which is even more, it's a big, beautiful heart. And, um, you know, you're just going to continue to open and open and open, but this is, you know, your opening, this is your, they're saying it's like your, your debut onto, you know, the Broadway showcase, you know, (laughs) But I, it, you know, I think the beauty, one of the things that I don't think people understand about mediumship is we really get an opportunity to sit with an individual soul and celebrate them because the spirit world will never come in and make you feel diminished about your life. They will help you heal. They'll help you release, but they will empower for sure. So when I connect to somebody's heart like yours, who really wants to be of service, who really wants to make a difference, it's breathtaking. So Thank you for caring the way that you do and also for translating your tragedy into hope. Well, wow. What an honor, Austin. Truly, thank you for your time. This was such a divine gift that we were able to connect today. And um, I'm just so thrilled to have met you. Uh, Lisa, thank you so much. I just have had such a good time. And I'm I'm honored to know that you're doing the work that you're doing because I can tell how genuine it is. Thank you. Thank you so much. And thank you for listening, everyone. And also stay tuned because I will pull some cards for you at the end of this broadcast. So aloha.